Yeah, you can. Alexa, turn on the lamp. Do you want to tell them or do you want me to? What's today? Starting vlogmas, babe. First day of vlogmas. do not even understand how excited I am for vlogmas because I didn't get to do it last year um, because I was sick but Jared just left to go to Lowe's because I'll show y'all in a minute but our dead bowl I broke it off in the door <laughs> like I don't even know how long ago that was so our front door has not been functional which we don't use the front door anyway but I was gonna today's vlogmas i'm gonna show you a decorated house tour for christmas and i'm like i'm just not walking back and forth to the garage so finally nagged him enough to go to lowe's and get a new one so i wanted to start do a little haul uh not haul a decorated house tour for christmas so we're gonna start outside milling which is damn well um, okay, so we're gonna start outside, and this is what I'm talking about. Like, I broke it off in the door. Hello, well, Bubbas. <laughs> okay. And also, also, too, <gasps> he done got my door dirty. Also, too, anything that i share on here and i can link it i'll i'm gonna try to be better about linking things that i talk about down in the description box for you guys to um get yourself okay so when you first walk on the front porch this right here is my little snowman mat. I just got this year at Walmart, actually. Again, I'm going to try to link everything if I can find it. Because a lot of my Christmas stuff is old. But this little vintage Santa Claus was actually my mama's. So, it's pretty old. And look, it still has the tag on it. <laughs> I've just never taken it off. Hannah's Handiworks. I might look that up and see if I can link it or find something similar for you guys. And then the front door wreath. I'm absolutely obsessed with it. I actually got this this year too. This is also from Walmart. It's just the flocked, um, flocked wreath. It matches our tree on the inside. I wanted to get some Christmas pillows, but it just wasn't on my radar. I kind of add a little bit each year. Anyways, and you come in and you get the doggies. Can't link those, can we, Nelly? But anyway, so here's the tree. Of course, I feel like Christmas trees never come off as pretty as they truly are on camera. I am obsessed with this tree. This tree is from Walmart. This is our third year putting it up. Unfortunately, this year we did have to buy lots to wrap because 
a lot of the lots were out. But that too, though, is how we store it because we're bad about just throwing it in the box. Like we don't close the box or anything. So that has a lot to do with it, but I absolutely love the flocked tree. I just don't think it's ever gonna, I thought this was gonna be a huge trend, but at this point, I'm not getting rid of the flocked tree. <laughs> okay, and then over here, I've got these little candlesticks up in the window, and they have like a flicker setting. It's either like you can keep it a solid flame or a flicker and we do the flicker but these were also my mama's so i'm sure you can find something on amazon i'm gonna look for you guys so yeah and then when you get closer to the tree like oh my gosh i just love the tree i love the flock but so like the bigger ornaments right here these again were my mama's and when it came to christmas stuff she did not skimp she didn't go to walmart she didn't go not that there's anything wrong with that because i mean that's where a lot of my stuff is from but she done like hobby lobby the christmas place i mean she did not skimp on her christmas and then these little crystal um hearts were also hers so i add these every year just make me think about her so pretty like the detailing and then I just got these box of pine cones years ago um, from Walmart. And then what else? And then I got the smaller gold ornaments um, from Walmart. Like those are mine. And then this ribbon, instead of wrapping it like I usually do, I done the trick where you cut it. Like you cut it and then like kind of tuck it to make it look like it's wrapping throughout the tree. But yes, I absolutely love my tree. I didn't do the topper this year because I just didn't want to. But yeah, and then um, my Christmas, my um, tree skirt, I'm pretty sure is from TJ Maxx. So, but it's gold and cream. Really pretty like stitched gold detailing. I was going to take it and have it embroidered um, the Souths on it. And then like the year we got married or something but yeah so there's that then moving over to the fireplace also i highly recommend going to youtube and just casting on your tv christmas tv art it is so beautiful and just have christmas music playing it's so cozy then we're moving on to the wreaths i got this tactical um stocking with that little thin blue line patch for jared oh gosh where did i find that gosh like i said this stuff is some of this stuff is super old but then that cream one i'm pretty sure it's just from walmart a few years ago and down here i absolutely love my sign the oh holy not sign i got that from kirkland's years ago and then i got this little tree from kirkland's years ago but um it has peeled over the years really bad from where it's been in the totes and like an idiot i just threw the pieces away <laughs> instead of just like trying to glue them back on but it's okay because i just face it that way and then here in the middle <laughs> this was my mama's the little reindeer and santa i love it's it's wooden and like vintagey and i'm absolutely obsessed with it i love it love it love it and then over here i have these stackable presents they do light up of course they're not on right now but i got these from kirkland's as well and then over here i got these little i just hang these little stockings on the hutch um i'm pretty sure i think i got these at kirkland's a couple years ago and moving to the table my absolute favorite part of decorating for christmas is my table it's changed a little bit but not too much Alrighty, so first my table runner is um 
from like a TJ Maxx home goods top store so I won't be able to link it but it's it's cream with the gold flakes on it so pretty and then I got these candlesticks from Hobby Lobby and I have two and then this I got from Kirkland years ago and let's see I added I went through and added because it just had silver and my theme is gold so I just took some of those gold ornaments and just stuck them down in the box. And I think it looks so good. You can actually DIY this for super cheap too. But yeah, there's that. And then my table settings. Okay, so I got these chargers from Kirkland's and they were on a really good sale. But the Dollar Tree has gold chargers. Just a tip. And then this white plate, it's glass and it's rimmed with gold. That is, these are from the Dollar Tree as well. And then my favorite part, I went to Goodwill this year and I thrifted, of course they're clean, but we don't eat all of, off of them anyway. But I thrifted these little plates and all of them are different. I'll show you all of them. Excuse me, actor boy. but the rim of them's gold too. And I just think it just match like so well. They're so cute. So that was that. And then these, um, the gold silverware, I, uh, I think I just got a box from like Walmart and the big ones are over there and the little ones are over here. We don't use this stuff, so. And this year we're not even hosting anything, so it's, it's all for looks this year. But then I got um, these gold napkin rings from Steinmar. I don't know if that's like a discount store. I'm not sure. Um, but then I cannot remember. I think I just got these at Hobby Lobby. They're just like, na well, they're napkins. Tea towels, whatever you want to call them. And then I just made them into the napkins. But those are my absolute favorite. This is my favorite thing to decorate every single year every single year and then let's see here okay and then this right here i just unloaded the dishwasher so but okay this little textured fluffy christmas tree and this gold um bottle tree is from the dollar tree they're such good quality and I absolutely love it. And then this bowl, I don't know if you can see like the um, detailing at the bottom. I don't know if that's gonna pick up, but it's also from the Dollar Tree. This whole, this whole centerpiece is from the Dollar Tree. And I spray painted it a satin black. And then I got this huge bag of really decent size uh, pine cones and they're cinnamon scented. So I kind of just DIY'd a little centerpiece for the bar. Absolutely love it. And then over here is my little nativity scene. I love the nativity scene always. Absolutely love it. Um, I'm trying to think. I think this was a Kirkland's find. I'm pretty sure. Eventually, I would love like the um, Willow Tree Angels set up. But yeah. And then this is the little section by my sink. I cleared a lot of it off, like stuff that we didn't use every single day. But I have this vase out year round and I just changed the inserts. But I got this little bushel, whatever you call it, of little uh, holly berries. And I just trimmed them to make them shorter so they would fit. And then I got these little trees again at the Dollar Tree and they came in a set of three. And they're just like little frosted trees and I love them so much. Moving on, I've got <laughs> my phone charging and my laptop charging. I'm actually house and dog sitting this weekend. So I gotta make sure all my stuff's good to go for Vlogmas. 
And then I got this Noel sign from Walmart last year, I think. It's wood. It's really good quality. Love the natural wood finish of it. And then, like, here, this is obviously, like, my coffee setup. And this right here, I thrifted this a long time ago. And it's been in one of our pantries because I just, I've not, I was going to put bath bombs in it, but I don't really use bath bombs enough to, like, set this out. So, I got these little bubble stickers from the Dollar Tree, and I just decorated, decorated it. I'm out of Nespresso pods, clearly. But I like the little tree like that facing out. So yeah, there's that. And then this little fella, he's from Target like a couple years ago. And he might even, no, he was for sure from Target. And then this little like wood Christmas tree, I got that at Walmart last year. They've got so many similar things this year. So I'm going to go through and link similar things as well. But then over here, I've got, this was from the Dollar Tree too. It just like, so cute. It has a little frosted tree, two little berries, and a pine cone with a little cork lid. And I just thought it blended like perfect right there with uh, my canisters. And then I don't decorate the bedroom or anything like that. But then our pantry door, I have this snowman wreath. His name is Charlie. <laughs> and it's funny because, I'm going to try not to cry. But my mom and I actually got these from Kirkland's together. Because I had just gotten married. And um, was decorating my apartment for the first time. And we got matching wreaths. And they actually like light up and stuff, but I retired this one to the inside after seven years of having it for the front door. But I just recently got that one from Walmart that I showed you guys. So this just has so much sentimental value. I cannot let it go. So even though I don't necessarily want it on the front anymore, I put it on my pantry door and I just love it. And mom is the one who named hers Charlie. So he's just Charlie. And I love him. So I'm trying to think. And like I don't do Christmas throw blankets. I really, I'm just, I'm pretty simple. But now like my table and stuff. Like I just done this today. Hang on. I put that basket up there with like a little tea towel in it. I could also maybe change the towel out seasonally. I don't know. And then the hallway, look. I don't know if, if y'all seen this, like if it's been that long since my last vlog. I swear this hallway is gonna get painted. But then, the only other thing else is like, because I keep that pretty simple and I didn't wanna take anything down. So I just put one of those little bottle trees up here. And this is from the Dollar Tree. Like it's really good quality too. It's really nice. You can like bend them and all that stuff. So that is the um, Christmas house tour. And I hope you guys liked it. Um, I'm going to wait for Jared to get back home from Lowe's. And we're going to put this door together. Or he's going to do the deadbolt. And I've got to pack, finish packing up a little bag really quick for... Um, Aunt Marsha's house, because that's where I'm staying until Sunday. But um, I'm trying to think. Yeah, that's pretty much it. And then I'll show y'all the dogs, her dogs and stuff. So yeah, just gonna wait for Jared to get back, um, eat some lunch, and then head out there. And I'll see y'all in a bit.
just come in a visit No, he wouldn't miss this In Christmas times Sneak a party? You want to sneak a party like a big bone? Come on, let's go. Come on, Elle. Come on, let's go party. Good boy. When I got here, they wouldn't come out. I think he was afraid of my puffer jacket. <laughs> I had to take it off. Oh my goodness, Hummy's a pretty boy. Yeah. Hummy's a pretty boy. Go party. Go potty like a big boy. <laughs> Look, she was growling at me two seconds ago. Now she wants up here. Now she wants up here with us and bubs. Yes. <laughs> Let me pick her up. <sighs> okay, so we're all settled in on the couch. Um, I just heated up my lunch. I just brought some leftovers from last night. And I've got my laptop and my little bag of my stuff i'm gonna have to have jared uh or i'll have to get my glue a nail popped off but it's totally fine um i'm about to say something i'm gonna catch up i've got laguna beach on and i'm gonna catch up i'm gonna go ahead and start putting some clips over to um over on my laptop just to kind of get ahead because that can be a lot and also their Wi-Fi is not the best out here because they have Frontier. <laughs> and um, so I'm just gonna try to get ahead while I'm just chilling with the dogs. And then I'm going to feed them at three. And then after I feed them, I'm gonna go back home um, just for a bit. And then me and Jared will come back out later. I'm probably gonna order some pizza tonight, I think. Look at Ellie. Y'all, this dog. She's the same breed as Millie, by the way. Mean as H-E double. You know, it's a Milo. Oh, they're eating their bones because somebody's here with them. But Aunt Marsha's tree is so pretty. She's already got presents out and everything. Yep, so just be chilling here with the dogs. A little update. I swear, if it's not one thing, it's another. It's truly another. So I was gonna try to get ahead with my Vlogmas footage. Go ahead and put everything over on my computer. That's not an issue, but my computer is from 2011 when I went to college. I have had to get this laptop serviced and cleared off, like wiped completely off three times. It's just so old. Like when I when I plugged it up, I heard it do like the, the charm, like when it turns on. And I thought, great, because when it does that, I already know that it's erased everything that I've that I've been doing on the laptop, like my passwords for everything. It just wipes it clean. Um, but it's like very, it's like very few times it'll it'll do that, like enough for me to stand it until I can get something else, you know. Um, but. It won't let me log into my iCloud. It's want me to put in an administrator's name and password so it can make changes to my account. Just stupid stuff. And I don't understand. I'm just done with the laptop. I'm done with it. Um, 
like I can go get a new laptop and an and an or an iPad if I wanted to, but I just I have I have the equipment. You know, like I have a desktop that's fine, but like I'm house sitting, so I'm not gonna be at home. Um so I looked it up on Walmart's website and I'm they have Ellie sound like she ain't gonna make it back there. But um they have like an adapter, like a charger port that goes at the end of your phone or iPad, whatever, and you can put your camera card in the adapter and you can put everything on your phone. I don't know why I just didn't think of that to begin with and they're like $13. So I'm fixing to feed the dogs really quick and then um, go get one because I'm not playing around when it, when it comes to Vlogmas this year. Um, especially on the first day. I'm just glad that I started trying to play around with it now um, instead of tonight and have an absolute meltdown and got couldn't get to Walmart or something. Um, so yeah, just to update what we do for y'all for Vlogmas. No, I'm just kidding, but it's because I've not vlogged in like forever. So, cause I told myself the last time that's what I needed to do was just go get one of those adapters because I'm probably not gonna get another laptop cause we have a desktop computer. I just really want an iPad, like a big iPad. So I'm probably just, cause I called Jared about in tears and he was like, well, just go, he's like, well, just, we're just going to go get you an iPad today. And I was like, no, I don't, I don't want to do that until I absolutely have to. Cause I don't care to edit on my phone. My phone has a huge screen. It's not, it's not an inconvenience for me. So that's what I've been dealing with. So I'm going to feed them and then I'm going to go to Walmart and get an adapter and come back out here and try to catch up for real this time. We just got back to Aunt Marsha's. We stopped and got some Din Din from Arby's. Um, I got me an adapter at Walmart. <laughs> we got back in the car, didn't work. I picked the wrong one and had to go back in and get a different one. But it's really neat, I'll link it if anyone else has this same issue, but it's an app like with the adapter and then when you plug it into your phone and put your SD card in it it'll show, show up on your app and you just select your clips and put them in your files and then you can save them on your phone super nice so Jared do you want to tell them what you ordered I got are you blurry probably I got a couple sliders and some mott sticks is that it I got curly fries and chicken tenders. Um, so we're just gonna eat. Um, I'm gonna be up pretty late tonight editing. So just wanted to check in. And if something happens and this is the last clip that I end up editing, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the first video of Vlogmas. I'm just trying to focus on that cup. I hope that wasn't blurry this whole time. Wow. Did you see what I meant? It was trying to focus on this cup. Mm. So, I know you were blurry. I couldn't tell if I was. Dang it. Anyway, so we're going to eat. If this is the last clip that I end up filming, I hope you enjoyed the, the first day of Vlogmas, and I will see you tomorrow. <laughs>